With us on set is Tina Izbiski, and she's going to be talking to us about retirement plans. And it's something I haven't even started thinking about, and I just turned 50. So welcome to the set. Help us understand how not to be ripped off with our 401ks. Oh, that's excellent. Excellent question. Um, as you know, I'm a CPA. I specialize in auditing 401k plans and 403b plans. And the industry, the way the trends are going right now, there are a lot of excessive fees associated with empl employer sponsors, 401k plans and 403b plans. Um, Especially Lockheed Martin. Didn't they just get in huge trouble for something? Yes, they what did. What happened with that? Yeah, well, there's a lot of litigation going out there right now. There's about 40 cases. Um, some of them have settled and some of them have been dismissed. But a couple of them to mention, Lockheed Martin had to settle for $62 million related to excessive fees in their 401k plan. And Ameriprise also just settled for $27.5 million. But there, there are a bunch more out there, and the trend is going to continue. The best thing to do is ensure that you have a qualified auditor auditing your plan that can properly advise you to ensure that the fees that are being paid in the plan are reasonable. It's not a standard auditing procedure but an auditor should be able to flag that out for you. So what you specifically love to do is you like to go in there, like the nitty gritty, and look at somebody's retirement plan and see if it's making sense? Absolutely, because it, it really serves as a protection for the employees to ensure that their money is going to the right place and that the funds that are being handled properly. And uh, as well, it's protection for the employer because you know, if something is not being operated correctly in the plan, it could there could be severe DOL fines in IRS penalties as well. Now, is it the company that actually hires you? So if you've got 100 or more employees, it's your responsibility to hire someone like you? Yeah, the, okay. the, the Department of Labor imposes a regulation that states that if an employer has 100 or more eligible uh, employees that can participate in a plan, then they're required to have an audit by a certified public accountant. But not all certified public accountants are qualified to do these audits. It's a highly regulated industry, and it really requires uh, an expertise um, to be able to conduct these audits. Now, what's so fascinating to me is that you find this fun. Yes, I, I love it. <laughs> um, I love it because there's a lot of interaction with the client because, the, you know, you know when, when there's a first-year audit, there are a lot of things wrong. Okay. Um, and it requires, you know, your involvement with the client to help them fix it. And that aspect I like, and getting the plans up and running to where they should be. So are you offering them an audit plus some maintenance, like some follow-up with them? Yeah, well, as part of our audit, we issue a letter that states everything that they have to correct with the plan. Um, and in order to do that, you know, they will need some guidance as well, whether it's from their auditor or from an ERISA attorney. Excellent. And how can somebody find you? How would they start? Oh, well, they can look for me on my website. In addition, I'm willing to offer a complimentary analysis of their 408B2 fees, which will help their employees save for retirement faster. Um, a one percentage difference in their fees with the plan can equate to 10 years of additional um, you know, work for the employee to make up those save, same retirement benefits. So a proactive, really great employer would want to prove to their employees that they care about them. Absolutely. And this would be one way, certainly, to do that. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thanks. And I tell you, I even was honest with you. I said, I don't even balance my checkbook. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like so bad with numbers. So it's really wonderful that there's people like you out there that can help make a difference. Yes. So great job, Tina. Thank you. You're welcome. Stay tuned for more on Live It Up. And if numbers aren't your thing, or if you have a company that has 100 or more eligible employees for a retirement plan, you might want to check out Tina because she can help you save money and do the right thing by everyone.